You're watching DIY Nate. If you enjoy this video, please consider subscribing. Don't forget to tell me about your project in the comments. Hey friends, today on DIY Nate, I'm sharing a pointer I recently had to use when my fire stick locked up on me and I couldn't get back to the home screen. The message I was seeing was home screen unavailable. It's not showing here, but this is what I ran into. I ended up resorting to a remote prompted factory reset and it did the job for me. It does clear and wipe all your information on your fire stick. So be prepared for having to reload all your apps and other download information. Amazon will retain some of your settings from your login with your profile, but I'm not gonna get into all that right now. Two pointers I would say before you go to the factory reset option. First, you can try just a simple reboot by holding the select button and the home button for around 10 to 20 seconds. So select is the middle and home and hold that for 10 to 20 seconds, which should start the fire stick over and solves a lot of the issues you may have. Another option here is I'm always a big fan of unplugging the fire stick from the base power location and waiting about 30 seconds before plugging it back in. That often works really well too. So if those don't work for you and you need to go through it, my case similarly, neither of those options work for me. And my fire stick kept showing the home screen unavailable. This also prevented me from getting to the settings menu area where I could execute a reset on the screen. So I resorted to doing the factory reset from the remote. This involves holding the back button and also holding the right direction on the navigation circle at the same time for about 10 to 15 seconds. At that point, the system will prompt you if you are sure you want a factory reset. It'll have a countdown and then after resetting, the system will prompt you to get your Amazon Fire Stick set back up again. If that doesn't work or you continue to have issues, you can always contact Amazon for their assistance. Or if you'd like to purchase a replacement Fire Stick, I'll leave a link in the video description below. Now, just to show you what I'm talking about here, we're gonna go ahead and uh, hold the back button, back arrow and the select right button at the same time. Sometimes you get a little bit of that clicking, so you might have to try it a few different times. So if you get a little uh, frustrated, it might not work right out of the gate. Keep trying, you'll eventually get it. You can see it's taking me a couple of shots here. So there we go, it's holding. And wait 10 to 15 seconds. And here we go. It says your factory gave us a countdown from 20 seconds, reset to factory defaults, been initiated and it will automatically occur in 12 seconds. I'm gonna click cancel because I don't want it to reset at this point. Cancel. One other option, at least on this version of the Fire Stick or this current application, is if I go over here to the settings and I click on my settings and then I drop down here to My Fire TV. In My Fire TV, I also have on the screen reset to factory defaults. When I was dealing with my home screen unavailable message though, I couldn't even get to this. So I had to use the reset by remote. So hopefully this helps with your problem. I hope this gets you up and running and thanks for watching DIY Nate. If you enjoyed this video it'd be great if you would like the video comment to let me know and then subscribe to my channel and set the alerts to notify you when i put out new content your support is greatly appreciated have a great day